This is Twit. Well, what I'm not looking forward to is the next uh, funeral taking place at the Google graveyard. Um, I think we're all really tired of spending time at the graveyard. It's been... uh, Actually, I'm not going to take this metaphor any further. I just realized <laughs> it's, it's not a good quick. metaphor to take in these extremely awful times. So I apologize if that was triggering for anybody. But the truth is that Google is killing gingerbread. It's not stabbing it to uh. death, but it, it is taking away the kind of support that you need for Google apps and services that you would need to actually use the Android OS. So... Google's officially ending what is called sign-in support, I guess, for devices running 2.3.7 and below. So Gingerbread 2.3.7 was the last version update for that particular OS. So everything before that is officially donezo. Now, Google's saying this is because trying to protect all y'all. I mean, Gingerbread doesn't have access to any of those fancy modern two-factor authentication, all those other ways that we've evolved to keep ourselves secure digitally. Uh, This is going to be effective on September 27th, 2021. It's going to affect Gmail, YouTube, and Google Maps, plus a plethora of other apps. Let's not forget, Gingerbread is when the Play Store was still called the Android Marketplace. And we've we've passed Evolve. Live uh, wallpapers were brand new. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's a good idea. What else came with gingerbread? I'm, I'm curious now. Live wallpapers was the new thing. I remember that because that was a uh, that was Nexus One, right? That was that was the thing with S. Nexus One. Was, Nexus was, was S. Yeah, it was, yes. Oh, was Nexus it the another S. partnership Samsung with Samsung? Made one. <laughs> well, wait a minute. Didn't the Nexus One have the the laser? Um, it the laser had a wallpaper couple that Google had provided, but it didn't open it up to yeah. other people making live wallpapers. Ah, later. that's the distinction. Okay, yeah. all right, thank you. Because so I was like, I know yeah. I saw it on the Nexus One, uh, but okay. But with, with the Nexus S, we also got uh, that was I think the first phone with NFC support, or the first like yes, official that's Google right. phone with NFC yes, support. Yes, that's I right. Remember that? Uh, that came with and then, Um, I yeah, let me NFC, see. Uh, that's right. I'm like really racking my brain for this one. Um. What we was, got oh, the, VoIP. Touch. That was the first uh, the first OS with VoIP calls. Dang, you're good, That's Russell. I correct. have to look at wow. Wikipedia for this stuff, but you're just like right off the right off the top of your head. That's that's amazing. Well, I put some things in my article at gizmodo.com. That works <laughs> too. Also includes. <laughs> I was going to say the copy and paste methodology, the one where we press and wait oh, for yeah. the menu to pop up. That started in Gingerbread, so something we still nice. use to this day. You know what, Gingerbread, another feature that happened with Gingerbread? It was the first time that there was an Android Easter egg. It yep. was the, well, according the to Wikipedia. The zombie gingerbread. The zombie gingerbread, man. Yeah. yeah. Oh, Very I disturbing, by the way. Person. Very disturbing. Yeah. It's not not I feeling I didn't really happy. appreciate all of the, the fun articles kind of poking at this being, you know, if you're a crazy person who still uses this phone, you will not <laughs> yes. support it anymore. Like the real reason that this was supported up until this point was because uh, there were a lot of indoor medical devices uh, that Google had licensed Android yeah. to that were running gingerbread. So things like uh, there were like advanced heart rate monitors and like check in devices oh, and things no like that. Way. Wow. Um, that's and so a bunch bad. of those things. We're running, uh, we're running gingerbread with uh, with a skin over top, and so those will no longer work. I doubt they very few not. people actually own gingerbread phones now. They should yeah. not. They should that not is be correct. running we, that. There yeah, are you walk anymore. into a lot of doctors' offices and stuff, and you see kind of like whatever that bland tablet is off to the side. It is almost always a really old version of Android. Oh. Yeah. yeah, yeah. When I was at the Oregon Zoo, uh, now when we just were on vacation, we were looking inside the polar bear quarters, the little offices, because you could see them work. Still using Windows XP. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. I please don't go after the Oregon Zoo because I told you that they are on very old OSs. It's just leave them alone. Yeah, you're not the only one that knows either. So I would I would also point out that Gingerbread is older than this show. Is it? Oh, well, I guess yes. yeah. So Gingerbread came out in t- December 2010, and we launched in we March launched. 2011. Yeah. Well, okay. So <laughs> wow, that was that was that that's was good, knowledge that's a right good there. Because we were cause we, in our first episode, we're talking about Honeycomb. Right. Tablet yeah, you're only. Right. You're right. Yeah. So our our beta or alpha and beta episodes were started in January. So right after yeah. Gingerbread. So yeah, yep. we were still sugar high on Gingerbread at that point. So sugar high. 
So sugar high. 